Yo, what's up, me YouTube? It's Paul Mike here, back with another video. So today I got you guys with the Jason Tatum build. And as you guys can see, when I make the build, if it's a build video and it's an NBA replica, we get it the exact same shade of Jason Tatum. Right here in the front, you see Jason Tatum. Now this build goes crazy. Now if you enjoy build videos and if you want me to make more of the build videos, don't forget to like and subscribe because we're so close to now 5K subscribes. I can't believe I'm saying this. Appreciate everybody to subscribe. And if you guys are new and if you guys enjoy build videos and stuff, don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any comments, y'all can put in the comment section below. But as you guys can see, it's the Jason Tatum build. It goes crazy on offense. And I, it's the offensive threat. But don't get it wrong, though. We got defense. I'm going I'm to explain to y'all in detail how to make the build. We got perimeter defense maxed out, steals maxed out. We should be straight. Now let's get right into the video. Now right here for the position, I'm making this a power forward. You guys can make it a small forward. It doesn't really matter. The thing is, do not make a center because even though you can make a center 6'9", I'm trying to make the lowest uh, way possible. So center lowest way possible and power forward lowest way possible is a little different. So just follow me step by step. I'll give you guys explanation or a detailed like explanation of what you need to do or what you not, don't need to do. So just put this position as a power forward, height 6'9", weight, put it to the lowest. We're trying to get the speed and acceleration as much as we can. We're going to get the vertical too. By the way, this is gonna have contact dunk too. We're gonna to be shooting from everywhere. We're gonna max out our ball handling, max out our perimeter. We should be crazy with it. Now, wingspan, we're gonna put it to the lowest. If it was gonna decrease some of our steals, it doesn't matter because we're gonna max out the steals as I told you guys, but we definitely need shooting. We definitely need shooting. And you can press continue. Now, right here, this is gonna be the build. On, uh, on, Driving dunk, to get the contact dunk, you need an 86 driving dunk. Right here, you're gonna need 86 driving dunk. That's gonna unlock the contact dunks. To actually unlock the contact dunk, you need a vertical too. Right here at 86, it's gonna unlock bunny and stuff, but we also need posterizer. Not only that, to, get, to unlock posterizer, you need a 70 vertical. But to unlock the animation, this is what I told you guys to follow me step by step. To unlock the animation, you'll need a 75. As you guys can see, from 69 to 70, right there, posterizer is gonna be on bronze. And right here at a 75, right here, at a posterizer is gonna be on silver. Not only that, the contact dunk is gonna be unlocked. Right here, the contact is gonna be a lot. Now driving layup, we're gonna have a solid driving layup at a 70, even though most likely we'll go for a drive, we're gonna max out the speed. We're probably gonna go for the contact dunk. We should have a solid driving layup, it's gonna give you uh, slip to stuff. We're gonna have a free list of stuff when we upgrade the physicals. But as of right now, we're gonna keep it like this right now. Just right now. Staying up, keep it at 50, solid, you know what I'm saying? 50 is gonna be not bad, you feel me? But right here on the three-pointer, we're gonna have an 82 three-pointer. Crazy three-pointer right now. It's not the best, but we're gonna have MIDI over the three-pointer. What that means is yeah, 82, but MIDI's gonna be at 89. That right there's gonna unlock more badge right here. Look, at 89, right there, blender's gonna be on gold, catch and shoot's gonna be on gold. This also is gonna help you guys on the MIDI. I mean on the three-pointer. So right here on the three-pointer, you also have this ST badge blinders on catch and shoot on gold. Claymore, Green Machine, Space Creator, and all those stuff guard up is gonna be on gold too. Crazy with on, on, on the on the shooting. Not only that, additionally, additionally, we're gonna max our ball handling. Don't max out speed with the ball, put it to 72. Right there is gonna unlock uh, speed boost, which we definitely need, 72. Now you may say 72, we didn't unlock, we, we unlocked uh, triple strike, but we didn't unlock speed booster. Why? Because we're not done with the physicals. But we, we need 72 uh, for later on to get the speed booster. Pass accuracy, you're gonna put it to 73. That right doesn't give you dimer on silver. Now dimer, uh, it's easy to unlock, but a silver is crazy. Now just put it to 73. I was looking it over and just check it, break start, break start and stuff. Not really worth it. Just put dimer on. We should be straight at silver. We have break starter and a replay passes, a special delivery. Oh, now bronze again. Special delivery kind of helps you on the self lob. You can kind of do self lob because you have a decent amount of driving lab and driving dunk. So that special delivery is gonna go crazy with it when you go for a drive. You know, if you if you try to play fancy, but on defense, yo, this book could play defense too. I told you guys right. Max out the perimeter. We have challenger anchor brace on gold. That's the eight tier badge. I don't know why challenger is not a. S tier. But again, we're gonna have uh, clamps too. We're gonna have, when we get strings, we're gonna get clamps. As of right now, it's not the last thing. Right here, max all the steals. Right there, all the interceptor gloves, right stick reaper is gonna be all unlocked. Not only that, everything's gonna be on bronze, but we're gonna have the stats for it that goes hand in hand. Now, we're gonna, additionally, we're gonna have blocks at an 80. We're gonna have blocks at an 80. Right there, it's gonna have chase down. We're gonna have more on chase down too, but we're gonna have it at 80 right quick. Just have that at 80. Right there, it's gonna have vertical. Not only that, we could have anchor. To have anchor though, you need more interior defense. So I put the interior defense at a 74. 61 gets you anchor over here. At 72, well about a 72, that's gonna have, have you, okay, hold up, we need this at 87. We cannot have this at 87. So we cannot have anchor on, even if we max out the blocks, we can have anchor on gold, meaning on silver. 
So we're gonna have it a bronze. So just put this back to 80. This is gonna be a waste. So just put this back to 80 and put this 72. Because 74 is really not gonna help you guys out. I mean 74 with strength. Okay, put it to 74. Let's get postal like that unlocked in this build. Even though we don't need as much, let's get postal like that unlocked in this build. I'll give you guys a different option later on. And speed right here. Remember, as you can see, Excel is gonna be maxed out. We have blow by, which is gonna help us for the driving dunk. I'll tell you guys in detail later on. Speed, put it to 75. Right here from 74 to 75. Hyper drive is on bronze. Speed booster is unlocked again. That badge is crazy. People go crazy for this badge. It's like the animation, the explosion animation. So you definitely need speed booster. So this build is gonna kind of go crazy. So if defense is playing you tight, you can go for a blow by or kind of use the speed booster for going for that driving dunk. Remember, it goes crazy with it. As you guys can see, the post drive, the slip three is all the way there. So we got it. Also, we can use uh, for fearless, we need strength. We will get we will lock strength. We're gonna have 75 strength, so we're gonna be straight with this. Matter of fact, let's go to strength right now. Put this to 75, same as vertical, right? When we have this 75, there's the physical handles on, and clamps is gonna be unlocked. And as you guys can see, when we move to driving dunk, not uh, I mean driving layup, the fearless is gonna be unlocked. Not too much, but it's still gonna be unlocked. Now you guys could put more on this, but of course we need stamina and stuff. You know, it's like so we're gonna max out the stamina on this build. We're not even done yet. We're not even done yet. Right there, it's gonna unlock handle for days and workhorse. Honestly speaking, 98 stamina is kind of too much on this boat. Hey, we don't need this much of stamina on this boat. So I personally would probably put it right here from 95. 95 would be straight because from 94 to 95, workhorse is gonna be downgraded. So keep it like that. And not only that, we're not done with this boat. That's why I'll give you guys leeway. So we have a huge amount of leeway on this boat because this is how you can make the boat, right? You can make it more of a, a shooting boot. I'm getting the shooting right here. You can max out the shooting right here. It's almost uh, maxed out. And then giving catch shooting on Hall of Fame. Guard, every, everything I told you is now is the Hall of Fame. So I told, I told you to follow me step by step. And put the rest of whatever you guys want. Let's say interior defense blocks. You can put whatever you want. But this boot is now we're going to focus on rebounding. Now to get the rebound, you could low-key get this uh, rebound chase if you guys need it. Sacrificing the mid-range. But this boot is going to be like a... A small forward, just not really focusing on the rebounding. So you're gonna use this on three scored and stuff. Do not use it much on the tools, unless you run it with a big. If, if you run it with a big, very solid build. And honestly, it's like you have perimeter there. If you're going against guards, you could play perimeter very solid. You could actually have strength over them, vertical over them, height over them. So you should be straight as a as a small, like as a small big, basically. But a run with like a popper and stuff, this build goes crazy with it on stage anywhere. One v ones again. I, 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 the rebounding kind of kills it, but other than that, you should be straight on this build. Now, you could probably put the rest on free throws if you're playing right to get that free, uh, free points. You could do standing duck, whatever you guys want. This is the concept of the build. If you guys have any modifications stuff, you guys can put in the comment section below. We are crazy in 2K24, so if you guys want challenge in any of those uh, 2K videos, yeah, I could put in the comment section below. 2K24, we grinding. And again, once more, I can't appreciate y'all. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I appreciate everybody to subscribe. We're on the way to 5K subscribers. So don't forget to like and subscribe. All right here, let me show you guys the Jason Tatum build right here on the Jason Tatum right here. The, the order kind of switched because I kind of modified the thing. Again, this is, how, this is how you modify it. So it's like, I guess it's more of the Kawhi Leonard book because we got the defense up, right? But it's up to your choice. And yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe. We're on the way to 5K subscribers. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe. I'm out.